Good afternoon, everyone, and welcome to watching Dee's Precious Nursery. I think it's been about 11 days since I've been on. I've been very, very busy lately. Very busy. I have grandchildren's graduations, and I've just been really busy. Well, today I got a box opening. Um, I've never ordered from this person. This is supposed to be a Boo Boo Cuddle Baby. So, um... Never gotten this type of box before either, so should be interesting. But I'm going to open this baby and see how this baby looks. A very, very reasonable price. Very reasonable price. And I'm trying to get more cuddle babies in my collection. I actually uh, have a cuddle baby head coming, just the head, because I have a body with no head. So I will be getting a head. I have a head coming for this um, body. But I'm going to have to take this apart because I need to add um, more weight to it. doesn't have enough weight to it. So, so let's get into opening this box. Um, I have the addresses and stuff on this side. And it's from Little Peeps Nursery. So I've never gotten from this artist before. So I know... Um, Recently, I, well, that's another, I'll talk about that on another video. So let's get into this and see. Oh, she didn't even tell me she was sending a magnet pacifier. That wasn't um, in there. It did say it had a magnet, but it didn't say if I was receiving one. Oh, and it came with a little stuffy dog. That's cute. I like yellow. I don't know, for some reason, I really like yellow and grays. And here comes the baby. And that is all that's in there. So I put that aside. Oh, it's nice weight. Really nice weight. Okay, so let's unwrap this baby. Oh, and it came in the outfit that it was um, posed in. Pictured in, sorry. Here are the legs. Nice weight. Kind of smells a little like smoke. Yeah, it kind of smells a little like smoke. I hope I can get that out. And there's the face. It has rooted hair. Oh, I love the face. Love the face. Look at that face. That is really cute. And the and this is the reason it was um, a boo-boo baby because a little paint rub off right there, which, you know, that doesn't bother me. But, hmm. I don't know. She, this, this baby does smell like smoke. really nicely weighted but I, I I hope I can get that smell out of the baby because I don't smoke so and that was not that was not in the description that it was coming from a smoke a house that smokes but you you can smell it on this baby you can definitely smell it on this baby. So, I don't know. Oh, gosh, it does smell. Oh, man. So, it's a little bit of a disappointing box opening. I'm not smelling it on the vinyl, which is good. And I don't know, I guess if I, if I can take, cause it's, it's smelling a little bit on the face. I could smell it a little bit on the face, but I'm sure that there's got to be a way that I can get that smell out of the body. Like I'm probably going to have to take it apart and wash the body or get a new body for this head. 
it was a really reasonable buy, but I think I should have still been told that it is um, coming from a, a house that smokes. Now, I don't know if... Yeah, it wasn't advertised. I don't know if... What? I got her off of Reborns.com. And I'm, I'm not one for one. I, I really don't want to put anybody down, but... No, this, this definitely smells like cigarette. Yeah, it definitely smells like cigarette smoke. So, oh man. And I, and the reason I got it is because it was reasonable. And, um, I don't mind that one spot in the back. And I really like the face expression. She did tell me that, um, she forgot to put the COA in the box and that she'd be sending it out. But even with this baby being really cheap and very reasonable, I'm, I don't like the smell of cigarette smoke. I, I mean, I really don't. Um, my home is smoke free. There's no smoking in my house. Nobody is allowed to smoke in my house. But I don't know. I mean, I, I can just smell it just from the baby sitting here. Wow, this is a disappointing box opening. I mean, I think the baby's cute. I think it was very reasonable for the baby. You know, it def definitely is a boo-boo baby because I can see some a little bit of peeling on the head. And the rooting's not all that great. But I just, I like the face on this baby. I thought the face was really cute. But um, hopefully I can take this head off and the body apart and... um. I don't know how to do that and try and wash the body and then put my own stuffing in there. It's weighted nicely, but I don't think I'm going to be able to keep the weighting material if it smells like, smells like cigarette smoke. Are you out in the living room? Yeah. Can you come here for a minute? Smell this baby and tell me if it smells like cigarette smoke to you. I'm still on video. Don't it? It stinks, right? I don't know what that smells like. Smell like yeah. cigarette smoke or something else. I don't know. That, no, smell this. I know, but I mean, it's. No, you like... can smell this. It smells like cigarette. Well, yeah, that and just. Something else. Something I... else. It's, that's gross. It smells like, how am I going to get the cigarette smoke, it, smoke out of this baby? Can you unstuff it and wash it? I don't know. I've never done that before. I don't have that many cuddle babies. But I can smell it. It's like... That's cigarette smoke. That's something else. I don't know. <laughs> that's what that is. That's, that's rotted cigarette smoke. Like... Like... Smell, smell right here. You could smell it. I'm still on video. Oh, yeah. Smell but it. I wonder if um you can take it apart and wash the body. Well, I have my own stuffing and weighting material, so that's not an issue, but I've never I've never taken a baby apart. I I I like the face. I think the face was different and, and the, the rooting is not really good at all, but like not good at all. But that's okay because I can stick a little hat on and all. I just. But you can smell it on this baby. Um, so. Well, maybe somebody can give you some advice. Yeah. If somebody can give me some advice, I'd really appreciate it. This is my second disappointing box opening. And you know what? It's funny. I'm going to talk about it on video. I wasn't going to, but I will anyway. My other disappointing box open, and I didn't share this with you because I saw it today. Somebody opened it. 
So some, some, the person that bought that baby that I sent back that I'm still fighting to get my money back, by the way, she resold it and somebody else bought it for like $130 cheaper than what I bought it for. And they love her. And I'm looking at the video and I'm like, man, that doll does not look painted good at all. Still is so pale. My AliExpress dolls definitely look better painted. And what was really funny on that is people that commented on my video that said how it doesn't look painted, they would send it back and all, commented on her video of how beautiful the baby is. <laughs> I mean, to her, I, well, to her well no be. to her it could yeah. be but i mean the people that commented on mine that agreed with me yeah. are commenting on hers it, it's just funny and i was talking to a couple of people about that today because i found to be it nice because yeah she really likes it you know? yeah that could be it yeah. but this is a disappointing box opening well maybe i didn't want it to be how to fix so it. yes i'm gonna bring it back up sorry about the glare I don't have the darker um, blackout curtains in here. So, and this light is glaring. Let me see if I can. Oh, that's much better. So if anybody has any advice on how to get the cigarette smell out of a baby, please let me know because, I mean, I'm not even going to, I am definitely going to message the person and tell them. You know, that it smells like cigarette smoke. But, um, yeah. And I did say her name on the, I did say the nursery that I got it from. And I'm sorry that I mentioned your nursery. But then again, I guess I'm not sorry I mentioned your nursery because then if somebody's sensitive to smoking, they're not going to want to, um, a baby that smells, but... I don't know if maybe she didn't do the baby and maybe she bought the baby and then resold it. So I don't know if if this person actually bought the baby. Oh, see, I can smell it. It smells like old cigarette smoke. You you smell. I know. Look at that face. Just give me that look like. I'm sorry. I stink. But you do stink. Hopefully I get the smell out of you because you got a really cute face. And the painting's not bad. The painting's not bad. Oh, the rooting's crappy. The rooting is not good at all. But the painting, the face is painted pretty good. I just hope I can... Oh man, I hope I can get that smell out. And this is actually cute, but I don't know. But um, if anybody has any advice on how to get, like, how to get the smell out, or am I going to just have to buy a whole new body to stick this head on? I know I'm probably going to, I'm definitely going to be taken apart because I definitely, I, I can't take that smell. I don't like it. I know, I know there are smokers out there. I know there is. And that's okay if you smoke and you don't mind your babies smelling like cigarette smoke. But I do because I do not smoke. And my nursery is, smells good. And my nursery smells good in here. And I don't want a baby to stink it up. But I'm going to have to. And I didn't want this to be a disappointing box open. I really didn't. And it turned out to be a disappointing box opening. But I think I should have been told that, you know, it was around cigarette smoke. I really do. And if it's not cigarette smoke, it's definitely a funky smell. Like, this baby stinks. It really does. It's really cute. And, and you know, it's painted good. Other than the rooting job and the cigarette smoke, it's, you know, painted good, but... And it was really cheap. But if I, personally, if I would have known it smelled like cigarette smoke or that funky smell that it has, it definitely smells like cigarette smoke. If it, if I would have known, I wouldn't have bought it. I definitely wouldn't have bought it because I will not buy a baby. Like, I've seen babies advertised where it says coming from a uh, smoke home. 
this did not say that because I would not have bought it if it did. So kind of a little disappointed. But if anybody has any advice, please let me know. I've never had this happen to me before. I've never gotten a baby that smells before. Like cigarette smoke. I mean, I did I did buy a baby where the vinyl had an odor to it and um and I couldn't take that odor. And I did have a baby where it didn't even look painted. But somebody else is very happy with that baby right now and I'm happy for them. I'm not going to mention the name or anything, but um and but I'm still fighting to get my money back for that um she actually blocked me on um after she sold the doll to somebody else she blocked me so I can't even message her and say anything but she did tell me when she sold the doll she would refund me the money which she did not so I'm right now in the process of doing a chargeback with my credit card company but um so I can't even message her I can't even leave a review because she blocked me so I can't do anything on her page and it makes me think like maybe um other people that have bought off her, she blocks them because she did say in one of her messages that she's dealt with people like me before. So I'm thinking that maybe, um, oh, I can't hold this doll. I'm going to have to wash up like it. Oh, man. Oh, that stinks too. So um, I'm wondering if people that, so that she doesn't get bad reviews, like maybe she's blocking them. And they can't leave a, a bad review because I couldn't. Um, but if that person's happy with a, a painted doll that doesn't look painted to me, it, um, my AliExpress dolls have um, more painting to them. Like this little girl right here. She is an AliExpress doll. And she's beautiful. I love her. I really do. I named her Bethany. I really love her. And she looks so much better painted than that doll that I sent back that I'm now fighting for my money back. I think it's very rude that she sold, resold the doll and I'm still fighting my credit card company because she chose not to give me my money back. So, oh my gosh, this doll. I'm going to get off of here because I'm going to have to put this doll in a box or something um, until I figure out, find out how to take care of it to get the smell out of it. If anybody can give me some advice. I know it's definitely going to have to be taken apart. Because if the body smells. I'm sure the stuffing inside smells. But um. Alright so. I want to thank everybody for subscribing. Um, thank you for watching Dee's Precious Nursery. I hope everybody has a good day. I hope everybody had a great weekend. Um, I will be doing another giveaway. When I reach 750. I think I'm at 662 right now. Um, I did notice that I lost a couple subscribers. That's okay. Um, but I gained a bunch. I gained a bunch and then lost like two. <laughs> so, but, um, I will do that other giveaway when, um, when I reach, um, 750, I already had the baby. The baby's already put together and waiting to go home to a new mommy and daddy. The last giveaway, um, uh, the person loves her baby, loves her baby, uh, she told me the name and everything. So I'm happy that that I was able to do that giveaway and make somebody happy. And I'm looking forward to doing the next giveaway. I already got the stuff together for the box opening, you know, because I throw in a couple outfits and diaper and a bottle and stuff, you know, make it a little bit more special than just a baby. So I am looking forward to doing that. Um, and I guess that's about all for now. Um, maybe I'll come on and do a changing baby, uh, changing video with a baby or, you know, just to chat and say hi and let you know how this goes with some advice. But um, I'm going to have to put this baby in a box because it's going to have to go. It's it, I'm going to put it in a box now. <laughs> I'm going to have to figure out how to get that smell out because... Um, I'm not going to worry about sending the baby back for a refund or any of that because I don't really want to go through that again with anybody else. Um, and with the one that I did send back, it cost me $35 to send the baby back, which I knew I was taking a loss on that. But not only did I take a loss on the $35, I'm now fighting to get my $390 back that I paid for a baby that didn't even look painted. But um, anyway, so... I guess that 
I don't know. It has another, it seems like a smoke smell, but it seems like another smell too. It's like really, mm. all right. So I hope everybody has a good day and, and I know I'll be on here before the week is up and I will say hello again. Any advice, please let me know. Oh, and no negative comments. Please, no negative comments. I, I will just delete them. I don't want any, I don't see why anybody would leave negative comments. I don't really get negative comments, so, you know, that's good. But, um, I don't want any still. <laughs> All right. I hope everybody has a good day for the fifth time. All right. Bye now.